The Military Bowl, Virginia Tech and Tulane. Virginia Tech, a 10.5-point favorite. Total of, no, sorry, a 10-point favorite right now. Uh, total is 45 on this. It's Wednesday, December 27th, 1 p.m. Central Time. Of course, God's Time Zone on ESPN. And we'll pull it up on the screen. Here's the deal. There are so many dudes out for Tulane. Willie Fritz has already gone to Houston. Uh, a lot of the coaching staff is sticking behind to coach the bowl game. But, man, a lot of their defensive front seven is uh, is sitting out for this one. They are transferring or they are sitting out for the NFL draft. It looks like Michael Pratt, the quarterback, is not going to play. Uh, we don't know if Kai Horton, the backup, is going to play or not. Uh, he's, he's a pretty good backup, but he is in the transfer portal. So we don't know exactly what's going to happen here. Um, we'll see. I suppose. But uh, my full season stats would have Tulane favored by 1.74. My power rating has Tulane favored by uh, about 5.5 points. But none of that matters because of all the guys that are going to be out for Tulane. Virginia Tech, this is a program that has momentum right now. And, you know, their quarterback, Kyron Jones, he is awesome. You look at these full season numbers, uh, Virginia Tech number 26 in PPA margin. Uh, Tulane, number 49, uh, which is kind of surprising, right? Um, I I don't really know what to make of it. Uh, but, you know, you look at the, uh, the team strength and whatnot. Virginia Tech, not quite there yet. Uh, it just goes to show you what you can do in the ACC. Uh, Virginia Tech, their team strength is not great. Their roster is not great. It's not even as good as Tulane's. And yet... It is what it is. Uh, number 26 PPA margin. Uh, they're number 41 offensive PPA per drive. Number 34 defensive PPA per drive. Tulane's offense was not good this year. I mean, and you can see it for yourself. Number 66 PPA per pass. Number 93 PPA per rush. Uh, Tajay Spears meant a lot to this team. And it wasn't just him because it's the offensive line as well. Offensive line yards, number 95. Uh, Virginia Tech's defense is number 10. Uh, stuff rate. Virginia Tech, number 16. Stuff rate allowed. Uh, Tulane is number 88. So they they haven't been able to get anything going. But when you look on defense, Tulane's defense has been legit. You want to talk about maybe the hire of the offseason uh, was Willie Fritz taking uh, uh, Chill Wood from Troy. And, I mean, number 25 PPA per pass, number 28 PPA per rush allowed. Uh, really, really good stuff from that Tulane defense. But let's move over. Let's take a look at the last six weeks. I would have Tulane favored by 5.42 if both rosters were completely uh, what they should be. Um, Virginia Tech now down to 59 PPA margin. Uh, Number 68 offensive PPA per drive. Number 41 defensive PPA per drive. So they've actually declined on both of those. Uh, Defensive success rate, pretty good for Virginia Tech. Uh, They're pretty good against the pass. Not great against the run, but it's not like Tulane is very good against the run regardless. So... Uh, moving over to Tulane on defense, they're better against the run. They're not as good against the pass. None of these ma- like none of these numbers matter. Like I'm, I'm just, I'm, I am wasting time talking about this. Uh, look, bottom line, Tulane's got too many dudes out, and I don't think they care. I don't think they care to be there. I think Virginia Tech wants to be there. I think Kyron Drones is explosive. I think he's going to be really, really fun to watch. And I think he's going to put up a bunch of points. I'm going to take Virginia Tech minus the 10. That's where the number is right now. I wouldn't go over probably 12. 12 and a half would be my cutoff for that. I like Virginia Tech a lot here. So give me Virginia Tech minus the 10 on that one. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question... You can email me, Gary, at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.